Hey Hunter, how's it going? Uh, Dave here with Rock Tamers over at the Apex booth, and we've got a couple new products for our Rock Tamers that I want to let you know about. Uh, first one is our light bar assembly. It puts right into your four-way in the back of the truck, and it's got uh, tail lights, turn signals, and brake lights. Eventually, there we go. It'll plug right in for you. Uh, it's super easy to install. Goes right on the carriage bolts. So you just loosen up, let's turn that down just a hair, there we go. Loosen up your bolts right on the on the top of the mud flap clamp there, and this will slide right in. It's got a nice channel seat, and uh, tighten those back down again, and you'll get, uh, get that all snug and fit. Comes on some uh, stretch cords, and like I said, it's got a uh, four-way plug-in, and one of the things that we've done special is that we've added a little bit of a twist to it, because when you've got both your seven-way and uh, and your four-way plugged in, sometimes the door kind of gets in the way a little bit, so we want to make sure we give you some extra room there so you can do both at the same time. Okay. Then a couple new accessory items are uh, got a Rock Tamers heat shield designed with the Duramax. Designed with the, the GMC and the Chevy, the Duramax diesel, when it goes into its regen mode, it's super hot, especially over on the uh, side of the mud flap where the uh, exhaust comes out by the stem. So this is just a little added protection to give it some extra help to keep that uh, heat in the distorted mud flap. It just goes right onto the back of the flap. Included with it, we've got some uh, matching hardware that matches our uh, trim plates. And it's also got the uh, sleeves in there so we don't crush too much when we're tightening down the bolts. So that's available. This one we had uh, last year's SEMA, but just in case you hadn't seen it yet, it's our Rock Tamers exhaust outlet, kind of designed for the Dodge Sport trucks and the Raptors in mind. But it helps when you've got uh, exhaust flowing straight back from the, from the vehicle, from the truck, the application that you're working. Basically what you do is you get everything adjusted in place like you want it, cut a hole in your mud flap, and then this sandwich is in between. It's got four screws that hold the back to the front, front yeah. to the back, either way, but let's that exhaust so flow free, flow straight through. It's a two pack, yeah. comes into it's RT200. And then uh, one last item that we've got to show you is our rock tamer hanger. So that's always been kind of a question. What happens with rock tamers when we're done towing? throw it underneath the boat, do we throw it in the shed, do we leave it attached? Well, leaving it attached would be best because that would do some advertising for us, so we'd like that. But if you want to hang it up in the garage, we made a, uh, a nice hanger for you that you can just set this on. And if you happen to uh, hang it up with your, your hitch installed, you've got a lot of extra weight on there and some of these hitches get super heavy. So we made sure to give you an extra kick plate to put on the wall there so we don't do some damage. And other than that, we are ready to go. These are the uh, light bars and the hangers going to be available late January or early February. We've got our first shipment of those coming in, but we wanted to make sure we released them for the And the rest of this is all available now, so come see us. Thanks.